Hello there, I'm Ilkay Bora and welcome to my tutorial series Lightning Sibelius. Today I will guide you through the process of enhancing your brush section by adding various cap mutes and modifying the playback of Note Performer within Sibelius. Note Performer offers a remarkable brush section, yet it seems that many users are unaware of the different cap mute options available, which greatly impact both the sound and playback quality. Let's begin by exploring what these mutes are and how to apply them effectively. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click on the top sub button below. If you like my tutorials and if you want to support my channel, you can also donate it via PayPal button in the description. Each mute option brings its own character and contributes the overall expressiveness and realism to the not performing brass section. By utilizing these mute possibilities effectively, you can enhance your compositions and achieve a more dynamic and nuanced brass sound. Applying cap mutes is a straightforward process. Simply make a selection of the brass section or a single instrument. Use the Technique Text Entry command by pressing Ctrl T and enter the name of the desired mute. That's all it takes. Let's listen before and after versions of this passage with the bucket mute. Alright, to simplify the process of applying the 5 different mute possibilities and to avoid overwhelming you with multiple options, I have developed a convenient plugin. With just a few clicks, you can easily apply the desired mute along with various additional commands from the list. This plugin will streamline the workflow and make it easier to manage the mutes effectively. It's called Add Brass Mutes Plugin. With this plugin, you can add brass mutes or other customized commands to the first selected notes of the selection or to the very beginning of the selection regardless of whether there are notes present or not. If you want to get the plugin, please contact me via my email address which you can find it in the description. And more importantly, you can customize the text entries on the list of this plugin however you want. You can write any kind of text to suit your needs. For example, if you want to use lead ring indication on percussions, all you need to do is run the plugin and select the corresponding text from the list. Let me demonstrate how to customize this list so you can better understand it. To do so, navigate to File, then Plugins, and select Edit Plugins. Locate the Add Brass Mutes plugin from the list and click on the Edit button. From the Data menu, choose the very first option, and all you need to do right now is to add your most frequently used text commands to this list. For instance, I will add non lasha vibrata for note performer, so I won't have to type it out each time. Once you have finished, simply click OK, then OK again. Now, when you run the plugin, you will see the text options on the list, ready to be selected. Alright, since we have learned how to add different types of mutes to the brass section, I invite you to try all different combinations and experiment with them. Please document the best results in your knowledge magazine. You can use Add Brass Mutes plugin to fasten this process. Thank you for watching the video. If you like my tutorial series, please subscribe to my channel and click on the top sub button below. If you want to support my channel, you can donate it via PayPal link in the description. See you soon in another mind-blowing Lightning Sibelius chapter.